and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Kelly Ray and I talk about motherhood and lifestyle. Today, I'm here with my husband Kyle and today we're gonna to be talking about why we moved to California, why we are now escaping California and how we got out of $80,000 worth, <laughs> worth of debt. Let's get into the video. The first thing we're gonna talk about is why did we move to California in the first place? So, the reason that we moved to California was actually a conversation I had with my sister. Um, before that, I had never even considered visiting California, really, to be honest with you. And so... Um, Let alone moving there. Yeah. And we had never even been up here to the Bay Area, San Francisco, none of this. Um, I had only been to California like three times and it was Same. to like San Diego. <laughs> I went to Los Angeles. Uh, so yeah. So we really had no experience of California, didn't know anything about it really, besides that we didn't want to be there. And uh I just happened to be talking to my sister about my job and what some of the benefits are and in California you can actually get higher pay and free rent with the work that I do. And so she kind of um, said something that really challenged my belief. She, all she ended up saying was, well, why wouldn't you consider moving there? And so I took a second and I really thought to myself, you know, why do I have this kind of attitude of like, you know, oh, I would never want to be there. I don't like that. And uh, I really took a, took a second and thought about, you know, what was best for my family and for our situation, our financial uh, needs. And, and you brought it up to me. Yeah. And, well, that's what I was about to say is, you know, I, I kind of opened my mind to it. And I went from that conversation and I went and talked to you and, and, uh, pretty quickly within just a few, a few weeks. Days. It, no, well, it was a few days. Yeah, but it took us a few weeks to actually to get out To here. move, yeah. But right. it took us a few days to come to a decision mm -hmm. and for you to actually start applying for jobs here. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, between the that conversation with my sister, maybe three weeks later, we were with a new job here in California. So, I went to a trade school and got certified and became a maintenance technician. After just a few months, I was able to get promoted to a supervisor. And being a maintenance supervisor, you get additional perks. Um, especially in California, you can actually get free rent and a lot higher of a pay rate. And so that is really what the decision boiled down to is we can get free rent, get higher pay, use that higher pay to save more money, and it's not going to a rent payment. Yeah. And so that kind of ties into our next section of how we were able to pay off our $80,000 worth of debt. In less than a year, honestly, less than half a year. We yeah. paid it off in a once, matter of months, like three months. Yeah, once Kelly started to research it, within like three months, we were done with the baby steps. Um, and maybe Kelly can kind of talk about what she did for that. Yeah, so I got on YouTube and I was searching everything about how we can get out of debt and how we can start maximizing how much money we're making and how much money we're saving. And the biggest thing that I, like the biggest channel I came across was the Ramsey Show channel. I watched a lot of these videos. I watched like over a hundred videos on this channel and, and just watching those like podcasts helped me to get an idea about how we could get out of debt for free. <laughs> and not have to pay into a service to help us get out of it. Um, so the first thing I learned is that we have to pay off our debt, smallest to largest. And so we started off by paying off our medical bills and our credit card expenses, which those costed us around $6,000 in debt. 
for having two babies and using our credit cards a bunch for a bunch of different reasons that we shouldn't have been using them. <laughs> so we started off with the credit cards and the medical bills, got rid of those. And then after that, we decided to go ahead and tackle our truck, which was honestly our biggest expense or not, not expense, our biggest debt. And the biggest expense. Yeah, expense biggest bill, expense yeah. too. <laughs> Both. Yeah. So it was our biggest debt and biz biggest expense. But the reasons behind getting rid of our truck the time that we did are super specific to us and was a good reason to get rid of the truck. And I'll have you explain a little bit about the timing and everything about the trucks. I don't understand all that. So our truck was about $60,000 of that $80,000 of debt. And so that was definitely the biggest concern and we were actually able to take the truck to a local dealer and get rid of it for pretty much what we had bought it for um, but unfortunately we had some bad debt from a previous vehicle and that is what really kind of uh, killed us and um, so we had a lot of bad debt we ended up having to pay like an extra 5000 to get rid, rid of the of truck. Them. Yeah. And um, so mm -hmm. sold it at the perfect day, honestly, probably. And the perfect location, just, you know, how expensive things are in the Bay Area, the prices here. And just that was exactly when dealerships wanted trucks. It was the highest price that we could have ever gotten from the dealer for that vehicle. And so it was honestly the perfect timing, so. Yeah, so we got rid of our truck. And then after that, we decided to tackle our student loan debt. And around this time, we were hearing a lot of, a lot of talk about how the student loan forgiveness program was going to take away and we should just wait on that and actually not do it. But instead we were like, you know what? We're gonna pay this thing off because this is what we're gonna do and this is our plan from the beginning. And we decided, you know what, on the Dave Ramsey yeah, channel, us, they talk about yeah. paying off your, your student loans regardless of what's gonna happen with that. And so we decided, you know, hey, let's just pay it off. And ours really weren't that expensive. I had a roughly $4,000 worth of student loan debt and Kyle had $10,000. $10, so we just decided let's just save up the money and pay it off. And around this time, I actually did decide to get a small part-time job at working nights, which was really difficult with a newborn baby. All this happened within like three months. Like we just were like, boom, boom, boom. And then right after that, we were like, hey, you know, we need a car. So we decided to also do the Dave Ramsey advice and we got ourselves a little small point A to point B car, nothing fancy. It was just the cheapest thing that we could find, honestly, on the used car market out here, which is still really expensive. Yeah, yeah money is not everything. And um, we were able to take this opportunity to get ourselves in a better financial situation, but uh, we just we don't want to be here and we don't want we don't have to be here and so we're ready to go We're ready to make our escape and we're excited about the future Yeah, we just wanted to share a little bit about how that came to be and thank you for watching this video